so hello and welcome friends uh, in this video we are going to see refresh the content of the home page like uh, whenever i am adding the data any data in uh, by using add a new employee so let me say abc and computer as a department so data is getting added for abc but we are not able to see that added data here so we uh, we need to refresh the whole page but uh, what we are going to do in this video we will uh, add one refresh content and we will pull it down and uh, after pull it down it will uh, refresh the content of my home page so you can see like uh, i need to refresh my page again and again so 19 data is now and details loaded successfully and you will see abc is here okay so we will do uh, something to resolve this we will add the refresh content to adding the refresh content we need to come on the employee details page.html file and uh, we need to add the refresh content here so as you can see the slot is fixed and uh, we are calling the refresh function do refresh function which will uh, we are going to define in the employee details page.ts file okay so in that we are going to define the do refresh function so this is the uh yeah so this is the syntax of the refresher you can use the ion refresher slot as fixed and ion refresher contained in that you can provide arrow drop down pull to refresh like this now just save it and uh, we'll see the refresh thing but as we don't uh, define uh, as we didn't define the function we will get some error so it is compiled successfully now let me uh, refresh it so it is refreshing but we are getting the error like uh, do refresh is not a function so we need to add a function in employee details page.ts which will uh, on refresh like this uh, do refresh function we need to add in that ts file this do refresh function with the parameter event and on that uh, do refresh function we need to call the load all function so that it will get me the latest data so console inside the log and uh, we are calling the load all function set timeout as this 2000 okay so just save it and uh, we'll see the result so just now now it is a 19 record just to refresh it begin sync operation sync operation has ended so again the function called and employee details loaded successfully with 19 record let me add another uh, record in that so that we will get 20 so i am passing xyz and department as can it here and just save it details added for xyz now xyz is not there but uh, when i pull down and refresh it 20 record is come in json format and uh, we are getting xyz here also so in this video what we have done like uh, to add the refresh function uh, we have added the refresh content that ion refresher inside the ion content and on the refresh we call the do refresh function and uh, when, when whenever the do refresh function will get call it will call the load all function and inside load all we have uh, called the function of get all employee and as it will get completed it will give me the all the employee details so this much on this video now in next video we will see the edit and uh, delete operation so thanks for watching and please subscribe to my channel thank you